We decorate for our retreat every year. I theme it out this year, it was Enjoy the Ride. So we had bicycle wheels and bicycles there, and we were going to pull in a sports car as well, a convertible, and put candy in the trunk, and it wouldn't fit through the door. So George said, I know somebody that has a smaller car. We're gonna make it happen for you. And don't you think, oh, he got one of his friends to bring their Mini Cooper, it drove it through the front door, parked it there, and we had a candy table right behind it. I don't know how he makes it happen, but he does. Um, and he's like, with you? The whole team is like, we're gonna make this happen with you. As far as hanging the bike wheels and getting the stage ready and the chairs up, anything I request for room settings, it just happens I, with a great attitude, and I, the customer service is just amazing. Uh, guest services to us is everything. We don't want you worrying about your rooms or your food or the venue you have. We want to do everything we can to make your retreat successful. That's what we're about. That's our purpose. That's our goal. We had a young person uh, who was here, and he's a great kid, man, just a great kid, but he had a really rough upbringing and a, and a rough home, and um, I remember he left in the middle of a service where the Lord was moving, and it was just kind of a quiet service. There was nothing really crazy going on, but the Lord just settled into the room, and, and the worship team was singing, and he kind of rushed out and rushed to the bathroom, and a couple of us adults went in, and we just found him crying in the bathroom, and uh, we just began to pray for him, and he just said that from the moment he got here at Bond Journal, he felt he felt the love of Christ and he felt the presence of the Lord. And and as a camp director, for me personally, that's that's what you're going for because a lot of these kids we don't know their life, we don't know their background, we don't know what kind of family they're raised in. But uh, when they come here, uh, we're trying to see that they have an experience and an encounter with the Holy Spirit and. And Bonjourno helps us to make that happen. Bonjourno, from the time we show up, they know that that's our heart, they know that that's our goal, and, and they make it happen for us. And so thanks to Bonjourno. Favorite part about my job is being able to help groups have the best experience possible here at Bonjourno. I love working with them, helping them to dream and see what their event could be like. Sometimes there are challenges. The groups that haven't been here before, they come with one expectation, and that's not what Bonjourno has to offer. But oftentimes, we're able to work together between the office staff and come up with something that makes their retreat experience the best possible. When we arrived, you know, we had to take our luggage off of a bus and we had to take all of that luggage to where we were staying. And I was telling one of the young ladies, I said, look, I said, we got a whole lot of luggage. What can we do? I said, somebody go and find a luggage conveyor. And when we went into the dining room, they said they didn't have them at the hotel. And as we're coming up the hill toward where we're being lodged, we were in the um, hotel east. There was a young man with what appeared to be a cart, just a cart, you know, for moving boxes, that sort of thing. And he said, ma'am, where are you going with all that luggage? And we're saying we're trying to get up the hill. And he says, here, and he unloads everything from his cart. And he says, you just put your luggage right on this cart. And he says, what I'm going to do is I'm going to help you get this luggage into your hotel so that you can get to the elevator. And I went, Shoo. what a lifesaver. He didn't have to do that. Probably wasn't part of his job. But because he has a heart of gold and because he's such an excellent, excellent employee, you know, we not only got our luggage into the hotel, but he helped us all that he could and that was just him just being a wonderful person that's that's the kind of blessings we've received while we've been here